Welcome back to Vlogmas day two. Today I was supposed to go into the office but because this morning when I woke up I was feeling quite crook, I have an itchy throat and I'm slightly feverish, I decided to stay home. But that does not mean that I wasn't busy, I had calls and meetings but we're just taking a little intermission because it's midday and so I'm going to cook my lunch. Today we're going to have some Angus beef burgers. And then I'm also going to peel some potatoes so that we can have those as well. Health is well. By the way, if you don't have your oil in a little spray bottle, what are you doing? Because this just makes it so much easier to cook and to distribute the oil and it lasts so much longer so you need to get on this our lunch is being cooked i am going to repost a creator's content that they made for one of my clients there is no breaks literally lunch when i wake up in the morning before i go to bed at night i am doing something creating something posting something this client is dolly's asai and it's actually the love child of my quite close friend it's an asai store they have a location in rhodes and another location opening up soon and I've seen how their business has developed since they first opened the doors and how much they've refined the product and how much love they've put into it. And I think it is so incredible. So I'm so excited to be a part of their journey. And if you're ever in the Rhodes Central area, go visit them, Dolly's Asai, level one next to X Active. They do the best Asai, dead as the best Asai. I just have to say that I for sure respect anyone that does Vlogmas because I started editing yesterday's vlog at about 7 a.m. this morning and throughout the day in between my work or my meetings, I've been trying to do a little bit of editing. It is now 5.36. I am going to head out to dinner soon and I am still editing this video, but it'll be good practice. The quicker that I can edit, the better it will be because the end of this month will be very busy. I'll be flying off to Malaysia and Bali. I'll be with friends. The commitment that goes into this, <laughs> I am fully starting to appreciate it. Tonight, we are gonna be going out to a restaurant. The restaurant is called Ray Izakaya. I just love Asian cuisine. There's something really, really comforting about it. We have a set menu planned. We've got entrees, drinks included, main course, sides, sushi selection, and sake. So you know it's gonna get a little bit boozy, which I don't actually think I can afford to be boozy because I'm not, I'm not feeling well today, but we'll see. 300 mils of sake, never hurt nobody. I feel a little bit embarrassed as I was leaving home and because I was so absorbed in messaging the client, I completely forgot a critical piece of equipment that I need for this food collaboration. Luckily, because the venue is quite close to home, Phil has kindly volunteered to run back and to grab that piece of equipment. So I'm so, 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 so grateful for him. Ah! It feels so silly. The venue looks really cute though. It's an izakaya style restaurant and we get a set menu. We're really excited to dig into it. The place is so aesthetic as well. There are all of these cute little touches. Thank you, I'm Will. So we drove here and then I ran home because <laughs> we got a good parking spot. <laughs> it was quicker for me to run home than to sit and pick our traffic. So I just ran home and got this stupid light <laughs> and came all the way back. Thank you so much, darling. I feel so bad. Will and I are trying to figure out what this is. I think it's a tomato, but he says it's not a tomato, so I'm going to taste it. And see. What do you think of the food, Will? Really good quality sashimi. Highly recommended. It's probably the best I've had in a long time. You know how usually sashimi is like sashimi, but this one's like fresh. Really, really good. Amazing. We now have had two double shots of sake and because I don't drink beer, Will has to drink a second beer. 